All right, night one of the Lexington Selected Yearlings sale is underway, and the stable.ca has made two purchases already, hip numbers 11 and 12. Anthony, let's start with number 11, a green shoe Colt, dual eligible, out of a sister to mission brief. Uh, was this one on the radar or just kind of one of those that uh, popped up in the moment and uh, happy to get? Uh, most definitely. It was just one of the ones that we had priced the horse. We had looked at them. You know, we don't know what the green shoes are going to do in this sale. I think a lot of people were kind of waffling. Even though if you look at the numbers, they're pretty strong in 2024. This is, this horse's brother is a mark of 53-2. and two, is a two-year-old now and $180,000 made. He's a legit nice horse in Go Dog Go. This is his full brother. And again, you see Mission Brief on that page. This horse doesn't bring this. It's just people are looking and saying, hey, I'd rather save my money for later on for something else, which is good. I don't blame them for doing that, but we're not going to do that. We're going to see if we can exploit opportunities when we can. This horse came up and looked good, and that's exactly what we did. It was funny you say that. We're, we're signing for the horse, and the next horse, when you and I were talking earlier, I was going to say 12. Yeah. But I said, you know, I think we legit have a shot at 12. I might bite my tongue a little bit. This was a horse that we all loved. Now, I'm not going to say it out loud, but there's the number. I had the horse priced at this morning. Infinitely higher. Yep. In fact, twice as high yep. as what we had to actually pay for the horse. And I thought we had him at 50 and 60. Just people stayed away from it. Here's a Walner. But again, is it the single jurisdiction? At the end of the day, we bite, both might be right at the end of the night. Hey, Doc. I was super pleased to get both these horses. Again, when we saw how high our first two picks went, I'm like, there's a legitimate chance that I'm just going to sit here all night and drink. <laughs> That's about it. And I'm just so pleased that we were able to pick those horses up when we did. And it gives hope for, for a lot of the other horses we're looking at in the rest of the sale. Are these storylines that are going to be unfolding? Are these just two horses in the middle of the sale that sold for less than what I thought they would have? I don't know yet. Yeah, exactly. And hip number 12, Royal Flush Deo, is a Walner Colt. Uh, first Colt out of Princess Deo. She was a stakes winner, but notably, second dam was the world champion, Queen Serene. So you got to be happy to get that. I wasn't sure a Walner on night one would be obtainable. I certainly did not think that horse would be. I think I thought of all of them. You and I talked about 106. I think 106 and 12 are very, very similar in the sense of what they're worth and what they might bring. I really just thought that horse would bring a lot more money to bring it to bring them to the stable for 85. I think just made all the sense in the world. All right, thanks so much, Anthony, and uh, we'll let you get back to it. Thanks very much.